Good evening, Internet, and as always, I hope this finds you well. A little more Gary Moore tonight. Now, this little gem is tucked right away at the end of the still got the blues solo. We are mixing up A minor pentatonic with a little bit of blue scale. Flat five, they're making an appearance, and a little bit of the natural minor scale with the B making an appearance. That's a second. So we're starting off with eight fret on the B string bend. That's a tone up, so you're going G into A, flat seven into root. Hit that, give it some vibrato as well. Then eight fret on the high E string. I like to use the little finger there. And then we've got a little pick on the fifth fret, E string, hammer to the eighth, pull back to the fifth, so sometimes referred to as a flick. Then down to the eighth fret, B. Then we're going to do that same manoeuvre moving down the string group. So five, hammer to eight, pull to five on the B, and then down to seven on the G. Then five, hammer to seven on, and back to five on the G, and down to seven on the D. So you've got that same motion moving your way down the scale. So that takes us to a little bluesy finger roll, laying that third finger back onto seventh fret G, then to the seventh fret D. And then hammer five to seven on the G. Then you're going to roll the fingers backwards onto the B string. Hammer five to eight on the B, roll backwards again onto the high E. And you're going to want to use a combination of finger roll and also, as you can see here, pick hand muting to keep those notes clean. Then we're coming back down, eight to five on the B, eight slid to seven to five on the G, so there's your blues scale note in there. And down to the 7th fret D, because of course your A root note. So, so far we've got... Then we've got the finger roll again, 7 to G, 7 to D. 5 to on the G, 7 to D. Then walking down 5, 4, so C to B, so the flat third in the second, on the G string. And then down to that 7th uh, fret D string, A root note. Then we're just going to carry on moving down, 5th fret on the D, 7th fret A, 5th on the A, 3rd to 2nd on the A. We're going to finish up by sliding very dramatically, G to A, 3rd fret and 5th fret on the low E string. So slowly, Gary more warp speed. And again, it's so much fun. <laughs> there we go. I'll see you next week. All the best.